Now, time for the best local sports show with sports anchor Bailey Arredondo. Glad to have you in with us this evening. We will get to the Lakers game against the team that hasn't won since October. The Firebirds beat the Abbotsford Canucks twice over the weekend and faced them for a third straight game here at home. And the last home game for the Birds was against the Canucks when they won on Halloween. Jack LaFontaine gets his first start in goal. The 25 year old call up from the ECHL. Just over a minute to start the game and the birds were flocking. They crash the Canucks goalie and Cameron Hughes scores his second goal in three games. Yeah, more than an elf. Hughes draws first blood. Now LaFontaine had 10 saves in the first period. Only one past the netminder. The Canucks tie the game in the 13th minute. Nearly 30 combined shots in the first frame. We're now in the second and a bird's power play. Keep up with the puck if you can. Precise passing turns into a Podorowski snipe. The veteran gives the Firebirds the lead 2-1. Now the Canucks tacked on two more goals, so birds down 3-2. Lynn to McCormick and the captain cashes it in. What a rip. Team leading 10th goal of the season for Max. Now this game was dicey down the stretch. Under a minute to go and a Canuck hits Connor Carrick in the face with his stick. Watch it, just away from the play right before overtime. This would send the Birds to a 5-4 power play. Then another penalty in overtime gave them a 5-3 advantage. And that's a death sentence. Podorowski scores the game-winning goal to give the Firebirds their first win at home in nearly two months. 4-3 the final. The Firebirds third win in a row and 13th on the season. Uh, the power players kind of struggled for us all night and you know they were frustrating us a lot to credit to their kill and uh, nothing's really come easy to us at home all year long and it's kind of the same thing that happened there on that power play at the end, but you know we stuck with it. We knew it wasn't going to be easy, and ultimately got the job done. Got a win at home, so uh, hopefully we can build off of that. You know we've really been playing for each other lately, um, having each other's backs out there, supporting each other, communicating, playing the right way. Guys are blocking shots, finishing checks. So um, I think we got four lines that are that are doing it right, and you know six D back there that are are doing a job, and um, you know everybody's doing their part, and uh, it's paying off.